Hey everybody, we're gonna do a, a quick overview of our automated traveling head presses. We just want to uh, do a video to help you understand a little bit uh, the, the scope and capability of these presses. Um, so obviously you, you have the base unit, um, you have control over sort of the x-axis movement of the head. Um, one of the cool things that is actually an add-on to uh, the head on this press is a variable control rotating platen, which allows you to um, nest your patterns onto your material so that you're minimizing waste. It also has a magnetic platen attached to the bottom of that for easy attachment and easy release of your dies. Um, we also have a nice picking table that comes with the base unit. Uh, this one has a roller on front because it's working in tandem with a waste recovery roller. Um, you actually have variable control over the tension on that. That's an upgrade from, from the normal press. This is a standalone operational control center. Um, these are an upgrade from the normal unit. The normal unit just has a uh, control box and touchscreen controls mounted to the side of it. But this one's really good for when you have a fully automated uh, application set up and you want to put some distance between the operator and the automatic control, the, the automated process that's going on over here. You've got stop controls here and on the control center. The press is also equipped with pinch rollers on the back. Uh, those come with the, the standard, the, the base automatic traveling head press. And it's got pneumatic tensioners that will just automatically suck up the, uh, the appropriate amount of pressure to advance your material well. Um, in the back, we've also got a roll stand. Um, we can do those roll stands in all kinds of different shapes and sizes and orientations. We've got, um, on this one, we've got three, uh, a three roll capability on that. Uh, they've got, uh, they really can come in various uh, weight ratings and um, anything like that. So I think these ones are graded for about 2,500 pounds per roll and we can do uh, two, four, six, eight, nine, however many uh, rolls you need to be able to go into the process. Um, other than that, each of these accessories are going to be overviewed on our accessories playlist on our YouTube channel. So we'll do a little bit more of an in-depth uh, look at each one of these accessories on that page.